In this video, I want to show you my new AI powered product description generator plugin for WooCommerce. So if you have an online store and then of course you know how important SEO is and how important the right product descriptions are and the right product titles are. And for this reason, I developed a new plugin that will help you with this or that will take over the writing of the product description that will uh, take over the improvement of the product description and also it writes um, SEO optimized product titles for you and this is what I want to show you in this video so here I am right now on a test store I created this test store and when we click here uh, on everything and here I created a test article these Apple AirPods um, as test article you can see, um, yeah, the product description is not that great. And also the product title is also not that great. And this is, um, yeah, what we want to improve in this video or what I want to show you how you can improve this uh, product detailed with AI. So all we have to do, or we have to install a new plugin. Um, let's go to the backend, to the WordPress WooCommerce backend here. And then let's go to plugins. And then let's install a new plugin. So we click here on add new plugin and then upload plugin. And then um, let me, where is my plugin? Here is my plugin. So we put it here and then we click on install now. And then we click on activate. So, and now you can see here is our new plugin. And also we find the plugin settings page on the left side here you can see AI generator. So we click here and then we land on the plugin settings page. And here we have to input our open AI API key. So of course, yeah, you need an uh, open AI API key. Of course, uh, I will put the link um, to the plugin and also uh, to the page where you can get the open AI API key. I will put all the links in the video description. Let me copy my API key. Let's put it in here. And then you can click uh, on test connection. So this uh, test if your a is test if your API key is valid. So here you can see a connection successful. So this means that my API key is valid. Um, now we can use with, uh, we can choose the different GPT models. So we can choose GPT-4 or we can uh, use GPT 3.5 Turbo. Of course, uh, 3.5 Turbo is um, a little bit uh, cheaper than um, GPT 4, but GPT 4, of course, it's better. So it's uh, up to you. Uh, let's for now, for this demonstration, let's use GPT 3.5. And here you can um, see the language. So if your shop is built in English, then of course, yeah, choose English. Um, if you have a German shop, a Spanish uh, or a French shop, then you can switch the languages here, but we leave it on English. And now here you can define the output length. So this means um, how long um, the output should be, how uh, much text uh, uh, your OpenAI integration should um, yeah, output. So, uh, it, you can choose from short, medium, or long. Let's leave it on medium. Um, you can select if um, yeah, the output should use emojis. So we can activate this and then uh, the tone, um, the tone of voice, uh, professional, casual, uh, luxury, playful. You can, yeah, you can play around with this. You can, you can test this. Uh, let's put it on casual, for example. Then we have some different other options here. Um, show SEO keyword fields. If you want to integrate uh, specific keywords, then you have the option here. Then um, the output template, you can play around with this. And then, yeah, we can click on save changes. Now everything is saved. And also when you, uh, when you generate the different, different texts, the different optimized titles, you can see um, the output tokens, how many output tokens you have created. Uh, everything will be tracked here. Um, of course, right now we have zero because we just installed the plugin on this website. Yeah, great. Then let's go uh, to our product field, all products. And here we can see our um, Apple AirPods test product. 
then we click here on edit, uh, open in a new tab. And now you can see we have these additional fields here. Um, here we can generate an AI title. Uh, here you can um, choose again the tone of voice. Um, yeah. Then you can add different keywords if you want to integrate different keywords, or you can leave this blank. If you leave this blank, then the, the AI will uh, use your existing uh, product title. And also on the product description, here you can see my product description that I currently have here. Um, here's the same. You can choose um, the tone of voice again. Then here you have the option to um, yeah, put in different keywords if you want to integrate different keywords here. And also we have the different buttons here. Here you can see generate with AI. Then um, your product description will get generated. And also here, if you have an already existing product description, then you can click on improve with SEO. Then your existing product description will get improved for better SEO rankings or better search engine um, optimization, uh, make it more engaging. We have a button here. We can expand this. If you uh, wrote yourself, if you wrote yourself a short product description, then you can click on expand. And then, yeah, your um, existing content will uh, expand. Or if you have, um, or if you want to shorten this, then we also have a shorten button. And a really cool thing is here, we have a generate SEO meta tags. So this means um, with the click of a button, um, the meta title will get generated and also the optimized uh, meta description will be generated. So this means, yeah, that uh, your product has um, the best chance of ranking high in the organic Google search. Uh, yeah, in the organic Google search. And yeah, then um, let's go up here and let's generate an optimized um, title for this product. So I click here on generate AI title. Um, okay, then this is our um, generated AI title. You can see we have emojis in it, or you can click on uh, regenerate if you don't like the title. Then we click on regenerate here. Now you can see um, we have this title, then we click on accept and it's already or automatically put into the title field. So this is good. Then we go uh, down here and then here you can see I can click on generate with AI for the main product description. Now our product description uh, is generated. Here you can see um, how this looks like. If you like it, then you can click on accept or if you don't like it, then you can click yeah again on regenerate and then a new product description will be generated. Okay, now I think this is good. Then I will click on accept. And now you can see this looks much better. So it's, uh, yeah, it's automatically pasted in here. Of course, you can edit this. Uh, you can click here, improve SEO. If you want to improve the SEO of this article, then yeah, I recommend that you input uh, some important keywords that you want to implement. Um, yeah, the more keywords you implement, the more SEO optimized keywords you, you input here. Um, yeah, the better it is for the AI. So then the AI exactly knows um, the keyword you want to optimize your articles for. Um, yeah, make it more engaging, uh, expand. Let's click here on expand, for example. Then I think we will get a longer, more detailed uh, article. Okay, cool. Then click here then you can see we have the longer article um okay perfect this looks good so then now um you can see we have the button here generate seo meta tags so right now i don't have installed yoast seo uh, i only want to show you how this works uh, simply click here generate seo meta tags and you can see um, again the tone of voice Let's put it on luxury, for example. Uh, same is here. You can input different keywords, but for now uh, we want to click only on generate. Then it should generate. Yeah, here you can see it's generated the SEO title. 
Um, this is the title and here is the meta description. Yeah, this looks really good. And then, yeah, you can copy it or automatically input it into your Yoast SEO SEO uh, tool. Yeah, perfect. Then let's close this. Yeah, that's, um, that's it. <laughs> so let's, let me go back to the settings page. Yeah, leave the site. Yeah, now you know exactly how this works. So yeah, you, now you never ever have to come up with ideas. You don't have to write them again. You can do this everything you can do everything on the product page and i think this is yeah really comfortable because you don't have to uh, use external tools uh, you don't have to jump around between the different tools you can do it everything uh, inside your shop inside the product page and this is i think really great yeah because you don't have to use uh, different tools you don't have to jump between uh, for example, ChatGPT, you can do it everything in the product uh, description or in the in the um, in the product page, and this is I think really great. So and yeah, everything is optimized. Uh, here you can see now the tokens we have used so far. You can play around with the different settings, uh, long and detailed uh, storytelling list based you can play around with this the output lengths you can uh, define the different output lengths different languages or yeah play around with um gpt3 or gpt4 um yeah play around with this i will put all the links in the video description down below if you want to have this plugin for your wordpress for your woocommerce store then um yeah go to the video description there you will find all the links and if you have any any question let me know in the comment section down below and yeah that's it for the video i think so if you found the video informative if you like the video then yeah i would appreciate if you press the thumbs up button and also yeah uh, make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel i'm a small creator and for me every thumbs up every subscription counts and yeah so then uh, thank you very much for your time thank you for watching and see you in the next video bye guys